But when I started, I like to like make it seem like we just. Hey, we go crazy. This is my man Reed. He always be like shouting his name out to the beginning. You cool with people that shout their name out to the beginning? Yeah, I guess. Yeah, I spit that fire. I ain't got London you. on the track now. Yeah. Okay. This is Cutting Way Podcast Episode 2 of 2022. <laughs> Shout out to Kanye. Circling back. Circling back. All right. Look. Look. Off the top, by the way. <clears throat> Look. I said, I know lately that we ain't did much, but on my mama, girl, I promise I'm going to make that up. I've been chilling on the block with the deals and lies, but I swear to God, all the time, I'm going to be in them thighs. Just let it ride. Let it die. Don't stop, bruh. Stop holding the mic. Okay, bet. That's my producer said. I'ma do it right. Why you cut off the beat? I can go aqua in this bitch. I don't really got the heat. I can go lava in this bitch. I can pass the ginger more. I go psycho in this bitch. Go ahead, Jay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Nigga Rico crazy. Rico yeah. crazy. Yeah. 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 We go crazy. Yeah. We go crazy. Yeah. Cut away podcast. Nigga, y'all lazy. Yeah. Yeah. Episode two in this bitch. Deuce. Valentine's Day. Who got a bitch? Ooh. Oh, I don't know. Maybe me. Maybe not. Okay. I don't know. I still got some crack on the pot. Ooh. Yeah. This is. Yeah. Ah. That boy cooking. That boy cooking. That boy cooking. That boy cooking. Hey, G, G, G rap like he about to get a deal tomorrow. Yeah, go yeah, ahead. Yeah, you, know, I got, you never know who watching. Okay, go ahead then, bro. Yeah. G King. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, uh. Chilling. Chilling. Chilling like a villain. I ain't even tripping because you know I be illing. On the mic. I'm getting tight. And I ain't even tripping cause I'm always right. Uh-huh. I had a date. Now I don't. <laughs> right, bro, you now be... <laughs> Cut it off, Mark. Cut it off, Mark. <laughs> He getting too personal. Yeah, I was trying to talk about some real stuff. I was talking about some real. I was trying to get real with it. You know what I mean? Got a Valentine's date. You know what I'm saying? But nigga, it's gonna be late. That lonely shit. I'm gonna be like everybody here. Hey, before we start, welcome back. This is another episode of Cutting Weight with Mally B and Jamar Neighbors. We got our main man G King back in this bitch. G Kizzle. Vallejo in this bitch. Vallejo. What the, what's the saying in Vallejo before I introduce our producer? Oh, V Town Valley Joe. There it is. Yeah, it and behind our cameras, we got our main man Mark. What up, gang? He hey, threw Mark. the peace Uh, bruh. Hey, <laughs> he Mark. threw the peace <laughs> Hey, Mark. <laughs> Yo, Rams in this bitch. Let's shout out to the Rams. LA Rams. We did it. We did it. We did yeah, it. we did it. Yeah, I don't like how you came in with a late applause. Yeah. You seen that thing I sent you with London? That was yeah, awesome. he was like, yo. <laughs> Malik from New Orleans. Stop claiming my city. <laughs> what are you talking about? I grew up out here, bro. London was like, I, I don't know no Rams wearing no blue. Blue Inglewood. out here. <laughs> I was there before that. You in Inglewood. You in Inglewood wearing you're, blue. You're, you're wearing oh, no my blue. God. Bro, I grew up out here, bro. What are you talking about? I feel I feel like if you grew, if you spend your most important years, which is the adolescent years of your 14, life. I say, I always say 13 to like. Thank you. And 19, that's, that's, 19, your most that's, you that's your most important year. Fine. If you want to claim the city, claim fine. It. The, claim, the, city ch- <laughs> the city claimed me. I didn't choose it. <laughs> I, I think I'm too old to be trying to claim LA now. Yeah. Just like, How many years you been out here? Six. Oh hell! You can't six. Claim you can't claim. I can't claim. Y'all, y'all want to adopt me? It's cool. That shit can't even read yet. I ain't even tripping. I ain't even tripping though, bro. You don't have it's enough. Cool. I, I don't want to like, claim LA. Six. I don't even want to claim LA, bro. <laughs> Bay Area all oh day. Oh my god! Know? Yee! I respect hey, the Bay, you know, man. Hey, yee! What you know about? <laughs> I'm from here. Yeah, he did hey, that last episode that too. Funny, by the way, <laughs> yeah, that's the Bay Area. Yeah, so. Yo, I remember we was uh in like we was in a spot this weekend. They was shaking the dreads. You remember that? Yeah. When the dude was shaking his dreads, yeah. I was like, oh okay, you brought back memories back home. Shake them dreads. <laughs> we brought it. They brought him here just for G to <laughs> feel at home. <laughs> he was shaking. Look, them G. Too. Look, he look, G. <laughs> you feel you safe? You safe? You amongst your friends. It's- for us Man. to be in the same state, bro, the Bay and LA is like two different worlds. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like you know, what's so crazy. California is so big. It's the only team that has four. Uh, different like NFL and NBA teams. Every in, they, in any other city, the most is three. LA has four. 
We got four what? We have four NFL teams. Well, I mean, I'm sorry, NBA. You're talking about, you're NBA. Talking about all California. California, California. The Kings, uh, the Warriors, the Clippers, the Lakers. Lakers. It's four teams. Damn, yeah. And name anything else in the NBA. Only the most they have is three in the other states. Oh, for real? Yeah. What about yeah. New York? Because not New York only has two. The Knicks, the Nets. Yeah, but the three, the third is Texas because Texas is so big. Because you have San Antonio, Dallas, and Houston. LA mm. is that big, and you understand. It's so big and it's so different everywhere. It's, you could it's be bizarre. driving up twelve hours and still be in California. Yeah, yeah. same thing with Texas. Texas is crazy too. Yeah, yeah Texas. Texas is more crazy. depressing to drive through too, man. Yeah. It just ain't no. Like, Texas is just like land. Not, like you just be like, <laughs> man, I be land out there. be like, I hate this. <laughs> what? Man, ain't no hills. Nothing. No. Hey, you don't appreciate the view of California to like, I remember my cousin came out here from the East Coast and we were driving. He was like, God damn, look at the hills. Like, <laughs> he's like looking at the mountains and yeah. the, the ocean. I'm like, dang, I ain't never thought it. I ain't gonna like, lie I to ain't you. never really thought about that. Like, I just, just I'm used to it. You know I mean? Yo, I'll be looking at, I'll be looking at LA on a TV screen. Like, look at my city. Yeah. Like, you, <laughs> you don't appreciate it till you like go somewhere else. <laughs> Fine. I mean, like, yo, every show at Echo Park and the sun shining, and it's yeah. like, yo, the drip of the uh, the trees and the buildings. Yeah. I'm like, damn, we really live here. We done made it. I grew up yeah. here. Uh-huh. <laughs> I don't know why you laughing, bro. Hey, tell them how much. Okay, let's, let me just tell you how much I'm I'm certified in LA. Everywhere yeah. we go and everywhere, every shoot we go, because we go to different cities to film. Can cities. you crip walk? Yeah, I can crip walk. Come I'll on, do I, do I, I, can, I can crip walk. I mean, and he, even... he 40. I'm not a crip walker. <laughs> Wait, hold on. <laughs> hey, when we got to be in 40, got to do a crip walker, though, bro. I can't crip walker. My bad. I'm not that yeah. That shit came out like a natural replay. Mm-hmm. My, hey, my uh, bad podcast, like man. My podcast age, I'm 35. <laughs> put my, podcast, how old you, Jamar? I'm 35, dog. Dang. Hey, put my, yeah, I'm, put I'm my old, age all on there, bro. Yeah, my bad. I apologize, I'm old, bro. bro. I'm 40, it was, y'all. 35. <laughs> It was oh, a reflex. <laughs> my podcast. Shit. Hey, it'd be funny. I'll be on stage. Should I be? I'm like, where my forty year olds at? It'd be hella quiet. I'd be like, ain't no forty. It's just me. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be like, damn, everybody young in this book. Hey, you hear that like, long cough? They'd <laughs> <laughs> be like, they leave me on pause. Like, oh, I'm only one forty. Bro, you like that sit too? Because I remember I seen a couple yeah, times you was, was at like, Bud the Race. Yeah. What the forty year olds at? Like, <laughs> Thirty-five years. You said, <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I know some forty-year. I'm, 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 I'm gonna start busting niggas. I, mean, yeah. I know you forty, dude. Y'all, if you're not, you look forty. Yeah. Now, um, everywhere we go in the city, we always say we always good. Yeah. We went to the Drake party this weekend. For real? Yeah. Yeah. yeah what In, happened? Invite only. Invite only. Yeah. Hey, didn't you, you see Mike Tyson? Huh? Why you wasn't I there? Uh, you said what? Why wasn't I there? See, why you didn't hear? What, was, what was you doing on Saturday? Oh, you had a show. You had a show. Oh yeah, I was I was too busy in San Diego being yeah. called a nigger. Boy, wait, wait, what? You said it with a hard R. He said it with a hard R. Who is he? No, no, put in Mark. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Mark is a producer. Mark, Mark, Mark said that. I'm about to say, hold on, San Mark, Diego like... fucking Laugh Factory. <laughs> hold on, tell us the story, bro. How how was that club though? Is it cool, San Diego? I'm saying that way. Damn, I hate ugly bitches. Uh, um, no, nah, I got a text message. And a bitch sent a, a picture, and I was like, "Why is this being sent to my phone?" Wait, you asked for a picture? Shit. Hell no, the bitch just sent it. I was like, "Why are you doing this?" That's what. See, ugly girls gotta validate themselves to still remind you, like, "Yo, this is who you're talking to." So they'll send a picture randomly. <laughs> you're yeah, like, 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 you, like, you do know that this is who you're talking. <laughs> <laughs> like, this, this is what you're missing. Just, 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 just to remind you. Just to remind you. Look, because I and, know. and she sent it on Valentine. She was trying to. She was shooting her shot. Well, yeah, it is. So. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> man, I was on stage, man, and I, I, I was, um, I had on some white socks. Actually, these same white socks. See this, and, and see how they're like linty, exactly. right there. Exactly. And I said, I said, oh my god, I said, I said, hey y'all, I got on white socks, and I said, and they're linty. And I was about to pick it. I swear to God, I was about to pick like the lint out. This is, um, this is a real story. I was about to pick the lint out like this, right? And I said. And I said, oh, no, I can't, I can't, I can't pick this cotton in front of all these white people, you know, just get a little cheap, little lab, whatever, you can get them start. Motherfucker, some guy said, do it, nigger. In front of the front row. <laughs> he went in the front row. That would have been two balls. <laughs> like, he, was, he was all in the dark. He was, like, he was all in the back. In the yeah, back. in the dark. <laughs> the cheap section. Can you imagine he was in the front? Like, yeah. Do it, nigger. <laughs> Damn, bro, you would have to fire on him. You, right there. It was the oh, mic in his hand, too. Hey, you, you with know, the mic in your he hand. You, mic. Hey, you, <laughs> you know what it is, bro? Because if you don't, like, like, when you, when 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 you get called nigger in front of hell of white people, they look at you. Like, if you if you, if you you reacted like, uh, 
then they think it's cool to say it. So yeah. you got to you got to bomb. You know what I'm saying? Because they know it's repercussions when yeah. when that word. Yeah. So, so I said, at least act so like you about to do it. So I said, who said that? <laughs> I said, that ain't sound like a nigga voice. And then, <laughs> so and, and, like and then the motherfucker doubled on God. He doubled down, bro. He was just like. Back here, I said it. I said, do it, nigger. He stood up or he just like, <laughs> nah, he, he, he was sitting down like this. Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Back here, I said, do it, nigger. And I said, and I was holding the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> I was holding the well, microphone. Talking, was it black people in there? Because you know. Uh, yeah, know. it was a couple. It was me, Shantae Wayans. <laughs> Shout out to Shantae. Uh, when when Dante Chang was in, when he, that's when he was with you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And then it was like, maybe like some, uh, like two other black people or whatever. Because that'll help you. So, wait. So, okay. So I say, so I said, oh, and I looked around and I was like, <coughs> and I dropped the mic and I said, boom, I dropped the mic and I fucking ran up to this nigga face. I said, what the fuck you say to me, nigga? <laughs> I'm still saying nigga. Yeah. But I was like, what the fuck you say to me, nigga? Yeah. I was like, who the fuck you think you talking to? I said, nigga, it's Black History Month. I'm to break your motherfucking jaw. Like all this shit. I was like mad serious. I didn't even know I had that try. I'm like one of the most transparent people ever, I thought. Mm -hmm. Whatever. So I was like, what's up, nigga? I said, we ain't talk that shit now. And then he was like, spooked, nigga. Like, and then I was like, like I, and I was like flinching now. I was like, nigga, I'll break your motherfucking jaw. I was like, cause I was really thinking about it. And then uh, and then uh the Laugh Factory people came and, and like and like carried him out and shit like that. And I said, and it's Black History Month. I said, and then, and then the black people after he left was like, like, yeah. And then I said, man, I went back on stage. I said, man, that's fucked up. I said, one of y'all owe me some white pussy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and then I went back into like my, yeah, my shit or whatever. Yeah. And then I was sitting around here thinking like, yo, did I do enough as a black man? Did I do enough? Yeah, as I a think black you man? did enough. I think, because what? Because you, because you, you, you made it seem like you would do something. You know what I'm saying? So it's like a, it was, I, you didn't just sit there and be like, this is, did he just, and you go without going with, going with, within your set, you you addressed it. I think that's. I think you did it. I think that would you, you have socked him, Alec? Well, you gotta understand what the situation is. Are they is the Laugh Factory paying me? Right? Are they gonna ban me if I knock this nigga out? That's what this. Is, I'm in your shoes, right? Mm -hmm. White guy out, right? <laughs> and you wearing these socks? Wearing these socks. <laughs> Cause he's a, he was right, you know what I mean? <laughs> Do it, nigger. He said, like, please pick those and let please pick the lid about them nappy. Come on, man. Let's take it. It is Black History Month. <laughs> Show how shit used to be. Cause nah. I was thinking about this. I was thinking about this. I said, well, damn, I said, uh, I said if I hit him, I said if I hit him, like I I feel like I I feel like I'll kill him. Whatever. Cause he's sitting down and I'm standing up and shit like that. He's in a very vulnerable position. I'm like, oh, that's all head right there. Yeah. I said, if you wanted to, and I was like, you should have put your finger in his eye at least and just like smile. Don't you ever? You would have did that. Yeah, do that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just like you just take a finger, you and then like I smushed his eyeball, like like no, don't you ever? And I turned it. Now if he just socked your hand away, that's you have. But now he hit you. Hey, that, he got he balls. You. Like that's that's he that fell a bow, bro. I was like, damn. What was you wearing to for him to just? I was that? wearing all what black. What made him feel comfortable yeah, to be like? Because mostly like white. You brolic too. I was wearing all black. I was I was looking very militant, bro, and I'm not even that guy. Like, I'm God, I'm just not. And then he was, but I felt disrespected as a human, a black man, and a performer. But performer first, though, right? Because I was up like, hey, hey, because like, you couldn't you couldn't be Jamar Malik, you couldn't be Jamar Neighbors on stage. On God, and then you had to like snap back. That's why you looked around. He was like, yo, you yeah. Was <laughs> so now you got to be Jamar Malik Neighbors. Now Sorry. He did, did, called you out as a person. Hey, did people normally the crowd would be on your back like, hey, bro? So 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 there was a lot of white people in the crowd, and they were looking like they were looking like shocked, like oh, like what are you gonna do? And then so I yeah 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 like like and, and I was like, oh, oh. <laughs> I just jumped in that nigga face. I was like, you you reacted. I, I, said, I, I don't know because because I'm I like G like G said nigga if you if you just let that shit ride then they all feel like it's okay. Well, I would have done it. So if that was a situation with me, he called me and word on the stage. I would have just twice. like yeah twice. I'd like yeah. You see, I just made a, a couple of jokes with it. Yeah. But then I'd have waited to after the show, mm -hmm. and I'd have hemmed him up. Mm. Because because you, for one, you still gotta have a job to to do. So you going you dropping the mic and running off stage. I think that like shocked everybody. Now it's commotion and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. So it's kind of hard. Like you don't want to react like that because if you are gonna commit, go all the way in. You should have do this something. But I was his first reaction, like Motherfucker, what? I know, I mean, but I, but I'm saying, but I'm saying professionally, you look at it like this: he ain't hurting you. Are you a nigga? 
Mm. Well, no, you know. <laughs> hey, but I, 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 I don't was, know. Like, but I, 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 oh, wait, 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 wait. Are you a nigga? No. Are you a nigga? No. <laughs> are not. you? Yeah. <laughs> See, I'm confused. Uh, I am. I'm a nigga. Hey, Mike, uh, you a nigga? <laughs> This nigga's Mark, bruh. Oh, Mark. <laughs> How you gonna say? I hey, but I, I just don't like, want. Hi, Mark. Then it's, hey, Mike. <laughs> hey, but we gotta keep bossing up when that word. We can't get where that. You well, know that's what I'm saying. But it's a time. they just get comfortable being like, it's a time. Sometimes place. I'm a nigga. It's a time and place for everything, bro. That's what I'm saying, bro. I don't don't react all emotional. That's what really, nah, bro. But that, but that, but nigga, but bro, that's just, came out, hey, bro. that's like just straight, like, bro, it, I that's felt just straight ignorant, bro. That's I, I just that's just like felt as a performer. Yeah. So I'm over here like, all right, all right, I'm I'm down with some heckles and shit. I will yeah. play with all. I don't give a fuck. What you are not gonna do is disrespect me. Is do all is do all that because now I'm like, oh, I feel like you're trying to big white little black me, and I mm-hmm. said I'm gonna fuck you up because I don't like disrespect. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It, it just as a fucking performer. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, don't disrespect my craft, nigga. I drove all the way from San Diego in a rental car, nigga. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I saw you that day. Yeah, bro. yeah, he yeah. Was at, he was at Sprouts. He was happy as hell. Hell yeah, <laughs> nigga. I felt good. My self esteem was all high riding yeah. around in that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, bro, you got a new car? I, was like, I didn't even answer. I was just something like, I was just something like, hey, what kind of, hey, what kind of rental do you have? <laughs> An accurate TL. <laughs> yeah. Hey, nigga, that shit was, hey, that shit was hey, that, that'd be called, hey, that He was sitting, hey, bro, but he was bumping in that thing. Hey, that he had the all black, black one. I was like, all right. Nigga, nigga, you know you, nigga, yeah. you, know you, you know you ride. Nigga, you know you riding good, nigga, when you drive like this. Bro, yeah, windows yeah. down. Take that long, you, take the <laughs> long, <laughs> you take the long ride. You take the long ride. The long route. The long way. The scenic route. Like, yeah, I said, you going to see me in this. I said, buy them out like this. Bro, <laughs> all loud, all loud, too, This is on Friday or Saturday? This is Saturday. I saw him, like, a couple hours before the show. I'm at the, I'm going to Sprouts. And, you know, I always randomly catch Jamar in the grocery store. Oh, uh, okay. And uh, I see him. I was like, bro, my man happy. And then later on the night, just the fact that, like, I thought that, like, trans, like, translate to the crowd. Like, yo, you just like. I was I was happy when I got there. I was very happy. I couldn't uh, wait. I ain't seen Josh trying to. I ain't yeah, he seen got, Dante. He, he got, aura, his, your aura hey, doesn't say. Jamar had to do that for the culture, bro. I, I get, I get it. Sometimes you got to, I get it. But I would, I would have never, man. I would have never. I just been, I just said some jokes to him, um. and then I, on oh God, I'd have waited after the show. Every nigga would have acted. Every let's let's let, let, let this is it. Every nigga would have reacted just different. Yeah, exactly. that's it. Exactly. That's it. What would you? Have it's done? no wrong or why. Right, I probably right, right. would have been like, "What the fuck you say?" Like, you would have probably kind of reacted like me. It, right? it'd have threw my whole set off. <laughs> like, trick, You're not thinking about this exactly. It, 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 it'd have threw me off. I wouldn't have been like, "Trick," you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you startled for the moment, right? But then it would startle me. I'd be like, "Wait, what the?" So now like, you just saying words, you getting aggressive, and now you acting. Like hey, that, bro, that that would throw me off, bro. Hey, it'll throw, retro- throw me off. My, I probably would react it. You see how I reacted when somebody put, threw some juice on my. Somebody threw some, some juice on you, man. I was at. I was at. Was you wearing a white t shirt? I was at third wheel, right, and I had my shoes, right. I was at the doctor. You know, you at know, the third wheel. Hey, hey but you, oh, hey, God. but you know, you know how you it's, fight hey, there. but hey. <laughs> But you know how it's something that happened That's prior to that? Like, house. I had wore these shoes, right? I just got them. And I was at the dime, right? At the bar, and this girl spilled a drink on my shoes. So you was wearing some brand new shoes, where? At the dime. At the dime. So, you know what I'm saying? And she, she spilled some, some... So I was already like, man, I, you know what I mean? So then I'm sitting at the mic, right? I'm sitting in the front of the third wheel, and this random white... This, this guy's performing with like a uh, tall clan of beer. And the white dude come and just knock it out of his hand, and the beer just all pour all on the ground and all on my shoes. And I was, and the white he just got up like he just knocked the beer. I was like, hey, I need it. <laughs> so I kind of like jammed them up about. They was like, G- I just lost it for a minute. But they was like, G King, I ain't never seen you. I was like, man, I'm tripping. But we, we got the backstory. Gee, just shoes, just the, shoes. Yeah, you know, you know, I don't play about my. <laughs> we got the backstory. Apparently, oh, the dude. guy. It was like they had like a little bet or whatnot, like a side bet. Whenever. Whenever, because uh, the, the dude was like, "Yo, he came outside with like what he had. He had some. He had a tall gland or something so, like that. So something. He, in his he knocked it out of his and hand. He knocked. He was like knocked out his hand, and the dude was so mad. He's like, "Wait, you know what? This is what I do. Because he felt like he was gonna cry. Whenever you see me drinking something on stage, you for the next year, you can knock it out of my hand whenever you want, and I won't. I can't react a certain way." He told him that that night. Later on, he got on the stage. She did exactly that. And then, I'm sitting in the front of my shoe. Like, shoes, like, <laughs> it's just all drenched in beer, bro. And Benji, it's all sticky. Residue. <laughs> he got beer residue. <laughs> Over your brand new shoes. Oh, my God. We're a very bad day for the shoes. Yeah, very so bad day. So I say, we got a Drake concert, right? Mm-hmm. And uh, what we didn't get into is an invite only. And our homie Jesse was like, bro, just pull up. We G King and I was thinking about shooting a skit. Mm-hmm. He was like, we're going to shoot, shoot a skit by Super Bowl weekend. Like, not getting into the parties. Then our homie ended up getting in. 
Mm-hmm. Right? He snuck in because he saw Joe Kim Noah. And this is what he does. This is a LA thing. When you see someone and you see a celebrity, you go to him like, yo, Joe Kim, what's up, bro? You know my um, blah, blah, blah. And then you act like you know them. Mm-hmm. And that's what he did. It was like, wait, wait, what? He just mentioned some names that, that like, I guess, they're close to Joe Kim Noah. He's mm-hmm. like, yeah, walk in with me. And he mm-hmm. walked in, right? And not mine, he was like, oh, shoot, all right, that's our way to get into the Drake joint. Mm-hmm. So G King and I, we thought we had hope. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so we get there, bro. It's three different lines to get into this party. It's mm-hmm. not no regular shit. Mm-hmm. It's like a regular line, a celebrity line, and a VIP line. Mm-hmm. So our dumbass go to the celebrity slash VIP line. Yeah, we in there. They so we there. had the first stage. The first stage is, they was like, yo, bro, nah, I'm, we on the phone with Jesse. He's already, he's inside. And he was like, hey, look, no, you got to go to the other line. We was like, nah, nah. He was like, look, Jesse comes outside. Like, they with us. They with us. He was like, all right, cool. They let, let G and I, we got in. Yo. Now this is the second line. No, your homie, remember? No, nah, no. Nah, we remember the first the first part was the uh, Jesse came out and we walked in. Now we got to get in line. There's like, nah, oh, we had the wristband. We couldn't get in with the wristband. No, but I'm saying this is when we first got there. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. It, your yeah, name was, on the yeah, list. Remember the another... name on the list, bro. We stood out there. We was looking stupid. You know, how, like you go to the club. There's like, who's in? Who's <laughs> who party are you in? We said Joe Kim Noah. The net. Your name, uh, Malik B. And then he was like, uh, I'm not seeing it. Your name. I this said my I name. I'm like, he was like, he already knew. He, <laughs> then he we, like, then, then we got the wristband. He was like, GK. Like, hey, it seemed like, it, <laughs> hey, bro. <laughs> you know how you know you about to get. I wasn't, I wasn't even, con- I wasn't, I wasn't even, I wasn't even confident. I was like, she's she like, your name. She just passed me. I knew my You're name went on. The list. I knew my name went Cause on. Cause you gotta list. understand, it's thousands of people behind us. He said it with all those. Yeah, your name. <laughs> then, then we get in the remember remember the wristband hey, hey Malik kept getting mad looking, I kept getting mad so look at so Jesse look at so bro. we got the wrist thing right so Jesse oh, yeah, got so in home, so and Jesse was on the phone like yeah get in so then we get to a part where Jesse couldn't get in because he didn't have the wrist thing oh my god so Malik had to get him a wrist and then I messed my, my wrist bro. thing messed up oh my god these guys was annoying me the whole night and so the black got, girl wouldn't let in. me the black girl wouldn't let me in she was like I had the wristband she's like it gotta be on your wrist I'm like shout out I, to the I, homie TB TB uh, he, he, you know my I'm brothers like, I got the... he got us in cause he does security for um, like um, who the fuck we Dr. Dre all, them, all those producers like uh, uh, Murder Beats and all those guys whatever so he got us a wristband mm-hmm. and he gave me one and then uh, no, the, he told the white guy, give me one, whoever the promoter is. And then I was like, well, I need two. He was like, you only get one. So I had to wait for G King. So y'all cut it in half. Yo, <laughs> but I told TB, I was like, TB, they ain't let my man in. He threw his, his cause he had all access. I was like, oh, that's hard, right? I couldn't leave my guy. So yeah. we get in, Jesse didn't have a wristband. I didn't know that. So in order to see Drake, you had to have a wristband. So, so I told him we was gonna do him like he did us. We was gonna be on the phone, be like, just go. Just, <laughs> <laughs> just say a name. Hey, Jesse, just say, uh. Jesse, man, shout out to Jesse. But Jesse, man, when he on that liquor, he a whole different person. Man, bro. that boy is, I had to break up a few so fights. So what was the party like? Bro, we saw everyone. I was I shot a video. You seen Tiana Taylor too. Tiana Taylor. I I got a video with Lizzo in the background. I should have got like a picture. Lizzo. At least Issa Rae was right in front of us. Issa Rae was right. He didn't want to get a picture. We got some pretty. Oh, you don't, okay? Let me see. Um, Big U. Big U was in there. Who shout was that? out. You don't know Big U, Nipsey, uh, for, uh the sixties. Oh, that sound like the shape of Lizzo. <laughs> I was like, yeah. we seen, hey, we seen uh, Cardi, Cardi B. Lick, this, 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 this well, Cardi B was in there. Cardi B, Migos, also. Oh, okay. Yeah, um, okay. Who else? Yeah, we seen uh, the dude that uh, yo, uh, Osiris who be owing everybody money. Okay. LeBron, we seen okay. LeBron, LeBron, Maverick. Oh, Maverick. Uh, he got his yeah. ass whooped that that night Ooh. in the Bay Area. Yeah, uh, the, the Lakers. He, he flew on the back. Plane. He, he hopped, hopped on the plane. plane. He was at the. It was the Drake, Drake. the same night. Yeah. <laughs> what that a beautiful life. And he broke Kareem. He broke Kareem. Oh, oh yeah, Jamar. They, they, they didn't even like. He didn't even celebrate. Like he well, broke, he broke the record, but he missed the free throw to win the game. So well, he, he didn't necessarily break it. It was like playoffs and regular season points combined. LeBron, yeah, LeBron. Oh, so he didn't break. He didn't break the actual. Uh, I mean, if you added all his points up ever in career playoffs and in um, regular season, it's more. Than oh, I was wondering why they didn't make a big deal out of yeah. it. I thought he was the all time like. Nah, bro, I thought he, got, he had he got Kareem. like two thousand more points to go. Oh, I, yeah. damn. I was like, yeah. dang. I thought I thought I was like, oh, he broke Kareem. I do your boy record. That's uh, a Gen Z stat or whatever they call the new generation. Oh, uh, yeah. okay. I was gonna be like, that's damn. Great. Drake Drake played us, bro. He was supposed to get on the stage at twelve. Hey, hey bro, he didn't get on to like one thirty. Oh, you saw him perform? Yeah, he, hey, he, he actually he 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 wasn't like I like the song, but. He was perform- a new song? His, he, nah, he performed just. Uh, but I'm saying he's not that really that that dope in concert. Like his he, stage presence. Yeah, it wasn't. Yes, it's garbage. His stage presence. <laughs> yeah, but he's a great. His music is dope, but his it's like. Is dope. Yeah, it was kind of like. Like I was a lot of people. Was more, I was more hyped when he brought Future out. 
Oh, oh Future was yeah, there? No, no, no. Yeah. Aisha, Aisha, oh, not. Oh, yeah. oh, man, now. Future came out. We didn't realize Lizzo, yeah. Cardi B, Migos, Future, Easter he brought Future Ray. out. <laughs> he brought Future He out. did like three songs. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. He, did March, songs? he did March Madness and he did- uh, uh, He did- uh, 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 The Commas. What are the Commas? Yeah, that's wow. right. And they uh, did uh, I'm Too Sexy. Yeah. We did March oh. Madness. You know, that was like a black national anthem. What the like, bitches look like in there? They was, man, bad <laughs> ones, bro. It was like, ooh, we was like, bad ones is like trying to get by. Like, go ahead. Go, 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 go ahead. I saw, the, grab bad, random I saw the baddest yeah. girl of my you life. Could, you could grab, because you was right next. You he could be right like, there. excuse he me. You was right there, bro. Was no, once you had a wristband, you was somebody. You grab anybody else. You could be yeah. anyone. Damn. Man, bro. I pulled the thickest chick. Remember the Boy, he pulled the baddest of the night. We was waiting in line. She was, I don't know. I don't. It wasn't real, though. Don't matter. Uh, she you ever fucking BBL? Nah, I never had. You? <sighs> yeah, I, man, I, I hate that shit. Well, it, it, it ain't it's cool. Just, it's hard. It's, it's hard. hard. It's just, yeah, it's hard. But it, but it looked good. Though. I ain't never. It's hard. It's, it's hard. Like, it when it, when it, it hurt. This. It hurts your yeah. You end You gotta get your. That's why. <laughs> Afterwards, afterwards, I, I did so many goddamn hip thrusts. Yeah, to get the little, the little massager thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's what they flying to Brazil for. That shit. It looked good though, man. They oh, were girl. all in there. You wanted the BBL? They had uh, the the CEO, the Twitter CEO, Jack. He left with a black thing. Oh, for like, real? That's yeah. what he got. He man, I need to get, talk to that nigga. Get my shit. My blue check reinstated. They, they said media. On Twitter? <laughs> hey, on media take out. Blue check. Hey, they said on media take out. Uh, <laughs> um, Sierra, Sierra, and uh, Sierra them left the concert when Future showed up. Yeah, that's what I heard. Yeah, they said they said they dipped out. They left right when Future got on stage. Like, it was time to go. Oh, damn. They was there for Drake. Yeah, you know. That's, that's petty. That's, she, that's, she had both her baby daddies who, there. Who's, hey, who's more petty, Sierra or Kanye West? Kanye. Kanye. Uh, Kanye. Hey, Kanye been petty. This whole, he was petty on the whole fucking Super Bowl, bro. Bro, he went on a. He was posting hell of much on during Sunday, this, dog. During this all about he pre- had a whole commercial. Nigga had the whole. All <laughs> about Pete Davidson. Yeah. <laughs> you would never meet my kids. <laughs> like, bro, why? why yo, him, and, him and Cuddy got into it, too. Yep. Oh, yeah, I saw that. He I was like, I don't want to be on your album, you dinosaur. Why you call me dinosaur? Because he old. Because he old. Yo, it's so funny. I want to be like yeah. somebody a dinosaur, bro. Forty four. Petty with Taylor Swift, he did. Yeah, he was petty, petty with Taylor Swift. But hold on, the whole, bro. Hold on. This is so funny. OBJ scored the touch, the opening touchdown. He sent out an Instagram tweet. You'll never meet my kids. It's not even a celebration about the Rams. He was, he didn't think about the touchdown. He was like, OBJ. Wild, dog. Yo, you think you think he gonna get Kim back? He doing a lot to do it, bro. You know, Valentine's Day today. He sent her like a. A, a truck full of roses. He a was black like, truck. A black truck with red inside. He making it scary. Like obsessive? Like, like, yeah. Yeah, because he's wearing like black. Like all the time. So he's Stalking. all black. Yeah. He always got them little boots on. Yeah, it's like, can you just... If, I bet if... I don't think he crazy, though. Because he maybe he's just madly in love. Man. No, I don't think he crazy. I don't think, man. I think he just he, misunderstood. Kim don't look like she got good box anyway. So I'm trying to figure out... I don't think so either. So like, I've seen the so tape. And I was like, she wasn't really doing nothing yeah. crazy. <laughs> like, it's she regular. Was, like, yeah. yeah. And she has three ex husbands. So I know they ain't fighting. And none yeah. of them fighting for it. Yeah. So I'm like, why is Kanye fighting so hard? Maybe he really wants his family together. I think I, he I, just I, wanted. I, really, I think he just. I mean, he got four. How many kids they got? They got a. Well, one is real and the other is fake. The other ones are They got two. Oh, no, two are real and the other Because they got like surrogate ones and yeah, shit. That's I don't the one like them about. kids. Like, not, not, not his kids. No disrespect to his kids. But, well, not. It's. it's it's hard to say like what kid is his and what kid is not. Oh, she's a perfect beard. Oh, Kim Kardashian. Yeah, to like how y'all like it? surrogate kids. Like y'all like. Uh, I ain't never. I ain't never like seen a surrogate kid. I seen one. up close. Like that's a surrogate. Like I seen one. They shake a little bit when you talk to them. Really? <laughs> I ain't never seen. Well, I ain't this never is a grown seen. person now, but it's but nobody never told bit. me like yeah, like nobody ever singled out their kids like that's mine. That's the surrogate kid. Surrogate like, kids come with Parkinson's. Yeah, yeah, they be like shaking a little bit, like something <laughs> right. <laughs> and and a lot of times they be coming out like twins and shit. It's always like twins too. It's always there's never one. It's always like two of them. Mm-hmm. It's like it's like you get the real one or whatever. You get you know you get so, the, you get, certain kids like twist. You get like the blue ivy one. Hey, and we, then after that, hey, you but get it, the ones you, they never ever show. Them if your if your if your brother was a <laughs> surrogate, you never see. You never see. You never, <laughs> never see them. Other hey, kids. would you make differences in your brothers if you like? Man, that's a sit. Man, surrogates be tripping. Like in a bagging like. session, and we all got to oh, hold the bag. Hey, <laughs> yo, that's the draw four yeah, card. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's why you ain't. That's why. <laughs> who your mama? <laughs> Why you ever talk about somebody's mama joke? <laughs> this is mom right here, nigga. Hey, mama, right hey, 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 my mama had me. I don't know who has you. <laughs> 
my mama. We all came to We came all came out the same pussy. We yo. might be <laughs> hey, we might be all under the same roof, but we ain't come out the same vagina. Yeah. Yo, what? Hey, that's good. Hey, yo, that's, that's a lot. Hey, but hey, but that's good. Give us some toothpaste. Hey, but it's gonna be hey, it's gonna be like that in the future though. It's gonna be hella surrogate kids. Bro, that's hilarious. They're gonna be shaking. They're gonna overheat. You said overheat. Overheat, nigga. In, the, in, in, in eighty degree weather. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> overheat in good weather, bro. Like the alternator guy gave out, bro. You stupid, bro. They gonna overheat. <laughs> Damn, I don't know if I want to have man. Man, I, man, I, want, I want my day, kids bro. natural, nigga. I'm Valentine's gonna... Day, what y'all doing tonight, man? You talking about kids? Trying to make some? Nah, I ain't trying to make none. <laughs> Nigga, please. Bro. I, I, I need to be. I, I, I'm. I'm. I need to be making some soon, though. I'll have unprotected sex, but I won't have any kids. Yeah. Oh, we know you. This is what you doing for Valentine's Day. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck. I gotta. I gotta. I gotta show. Uh, maybe. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I gotta see who liked me tonight. <laughs> <laughs> tonight. I gotta see who liked me tonight. <laughs> Man, trying to balance out man. comedy and real Chicks life. Chicks be tripping, bro. Yeah. If you out there and you like me. Oh, shoot your shit. What you, yeah, shoot you out there, you like me, you a female, <laughs> hit me up. That's it? But you what don't what like, you want you, me to say? but you don't like, you just said a couple of prior to this uh, podcast, you was like, I don't like, I hate ugly bitches. So you, you gotta like, make sure you separate. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. yeah and no ugly hoes. There it is. You know? What you were saying? I'm the only nigga allowed to be ugly in the, in the partnership. Because yeah. you can't have, you can't have like two it's, ugly. Nah, I'm, I'm saying fine. like being being a comic, bro. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm fine. To, I was about to roll hey, with you. About to be like, nah, about nah, to... nah, I feel you, Jamar. Only you can be. <laughs> <Okay>. Hey, <laughs> wait. What is he gonna say? I'm saying being a comedian, it'd be hard to balance. <laughs> it'd be hard to balance out comedy and dating and all that, man. Shit, yeah, bro. You gotta have like a another show? Thing. Yeah, I got another, another show. show. What you doing? We can't ever plan nothing for the weekend. I got a show. Shooting skits. Shows. You shooting skits with Malik? Oh, Malik got me in trouble. I, gotta go shoot I got you skits. in trouble? Yeah, bro. Oh. Just beat me out. Like, <laughs> you at the Drake concert again? She started asking me. She was like, so I, I told her, I told her I didn't, uh, she asked me where I went to the Super Bowl. And I was like, I was just chilling. She was like, so all your friends, they were, they were, they were out with their girlfriends, huh? I'm like, nah, they was, you know what I mean? Like, Damn, bro, let me man. throw me in it, bro. My girl be good. She cool as hell, bro. Yeah, man, she be Damn. tripping. Well, let me talk to her. Shit. Yeah, we doing Valentine's Day tomorrow because she know I have a show. So we just. Oh, uh, that's cool. Know. Yeah. <laughs> it's just a day, nigga. It's just a day. I ain't about to have society tell me a day, a specific day that why I should love my girl. Get the fuck up out of here. And I told her that. She was like, Yeah, you're right, babe. Damn, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, you're right. Let me call, let me call one of these hoes. Call him, bro. Call we ain't doing him. nothing. Yeah, bro. Straight up. That's how that's how I come. <laughs> that's like you want to be like Malik B, you gotta put you gotta lay the law down, bro. Another man. day, really. Yeah, I want to be like Malik B. He <laughs> said, <laughs> <laughs> "You want to be like Malik B?" Another day. That's all. Hey, I, I told the bitch, I said, "Nigga, I'm a, I'm a, I'm Jehovah Witness, nigga. I don't celebrate Valentine's." Hold on, bro. Uh, we gotta do a fan question. Dude told me. To oh, nigga, we gotta talk about these box and shits. Hold on. All right, go ahead. Go ahead. Do it. Do it right now. All right, nigga. Uh, wait. Hold up. Let's see what's out there. All right. All right. All right. All right. Hold all on. Right. Let's do this real quick. Sean Porter said, "Boots is overrated." Yeah, he, that's cap. That's cap. Uh, Sean Porter. Uh, before he retired, he said Boots is one of them guys. Then you know he want to make, and we love. We had Shine on here, you know Shine the homie, but it's just it's just like click, clickbait for his podcast. Then more than nothing. Oh, else. he he retired. Yeah, oh, uh, Terrence right. Crawford retired him. Oh, even though he say he didn't, Terrence Crawford didn't retire him. Terrence Crawford retired. Him. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> how, how how what's the what's the going rate of Boots. retirement for boxing? Shit, how many knockout? How many times you got knocked out? Boots is hard, nigga. I'm like, saying like overall, like about like what thirty five? Are they are 30, still uh, thirty? Because um, it's some thirty five year olds is like running. Like Canelo is what thirty two? He's he thirty one. He like a kid. Well, I'm saying, but there ain't no boxers that like forty still. Like. Shit, shit, bro. Yeah, so Gennady Golovkin, uh, forty. Damn it, yeah. For real? Yeah, Damn. nigga, forty. Lomachenko up there. Lomachenko, man, that nigga is thirty three. He thirty three. <laughs> that nigga old. Oh shit. He, I don't know. Is, he, is that old or not? But know. like boxing age, is that? Because like, Terrence Crawford don't look old, and he thirty five. What is your prime in boxing? Like 20, 25, 24? Shit, yeah. That's when you like you at you your, your ultimate peak. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. I don't think Boots is overrated. I just think he ain't fought the uh, uh like he can't he get he a fight. Doing, can't get yeah, a fight. He, he know what the fuck he's supposed to do to his competition and shit. Same with Virgil Ortiz. I think him and Virgil Ortiz need to fight, bro. They can't they on the same level. Can't get a fight, bro. You got to You beat whoever in front of you. It's like All the right. Boston Celtics on an eight, ten game win streak. 
They playing sorry competition, but they beat. They getting them out. The, they getting them fucked up out of there. Charlo accused of battery. Yeah, he got arrested over the weekend. Um, Maybe fight his cousin or some shit at a barbecue or something. Kodak yeah. got shot too. You heard about yeah, that? At the Bieber concert or some yeah, shit. Yeah, right? the, the, the street from it. How you feel about? You said that? you heard the gunshots. Wait, what? Y'all was at? Wait, wait, wait. Why? Why was y'all weekend so much better than mine? <laughs> 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 Friday, hey, yeah, fr- Friday, right. we Tony Roberts. We were talking Tony, bro. See, yeah, yeah. And it, bro, man, hella, hey, hella, them OG chicks was in my DM, dog. You are so funny, baby. For real, man, they was. He rocked out too, by the way. I rocked Boy, out, hey, he listen. I think Tony Roberts is the greatest of all time. And talking about comedians, right? yeah, he's funny, that's my bro. personal yeah. favorite. Yeah. So when G told me he's opening up for him, I had a show on Friday. I literally left. I did got on stage and rushed over to G. I missed his set, but just to hear Tony Roberts to say. I don't want to take away your moment, but go no, ahead. Go and tell ahead, me. go ahead. Oh, okay, I'll tell him. He was like, bro, I never seen you look so comfortable on stage. Yeah. He's like, bro, you have, I literally saw, he was like, bro, you had me over here dying. And yeah, just to yeah. see them, hear the goat say that. Yeah. Then he goes up and for an hour straight, I'm talking about, yo, to the point like, bro, your stomach hurts. Yeah. He for hour, it's, no, he does when not he let up. back out here? No, no. no. You, that's, that's, I paid my money to go. I was Tony like. Roberts is funny, bro. He's so funny, bro. I was like, I, and then G so cool. He was like, this is my man Malik. I was like, damn, bro. This dude he said he knew you. He was like, oh, I know him. Yo, like, I seen you on something. I, I didn't even yeah. pissed on myself. Man. And what I like, what I like about Tony, <laughs> man, he just you. he just go and be funny. He don't the whole time yeah. think shit. Nope. Nah, man. Natural. He just <laughs> that nigga said. Uh, he said, nigga, I went on Spirit flight. He said, I took a flight to Spirit. And them niggas lost my uh my uh, my carry on. <laughs> Oh yeah, say, bro, lost my carry on. <laughs> he said, nigga. He said, where your bag, nigga? What's but my head? <laughs> 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 bro, I mean, but if you stuff like that, you be like, so this funny, man. This nigga said, "Man, I got a dumbass family." He said, "I got an auntie. Yep. She gonna name a she gonna name a kid. She said she had twins. She gonna name one Denise and one the nephew." Bro, hilarious. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> like, who thinks of shit like that? What? Bro, yeah. I remember he was like my wife because he kept saying like his new set, his new uh, special gonna be like funny faith and uh, family, right? Because that's mm. a fly, the three F's he believes in. He was talking about his wife. I, and my favorite joke, he mixed it in, incorporated. He was like, yo, my wife, you know what I mean? They don't be, she don't like to have, like, she don't be making noises. He was like, nah, that ain't what I like. And he was like, he took a pen and I stabbed her. She's like, ah! Oh. He was like, yeah, that's what I like to hear. Come on, go ahead. <laughs> ah, ah, yeah. <laughs> you hear that, neighbor? So he be knocking on the, do it again. Tony funny, bro. Bro, he's hilarious. Bro. He said, well, he said he don't like to hear, like, he don't like silence. Mm-hmm. He was like, I got to have it, like. That's why he nonstop. Like, if he gets silence, he get nervous. Like, he feel like he bombing. Really? Like, it's got to be. He got to. So, he writes his punchlines. Like I respect that. that. That's hard. Yeah. And he always moving. He always got to. Do you, do you like that kind of style of comedy? Because yeah. G, G, basically, you had, like, a question afterwards. Like, um, um, like I remember David, David Arnold, when I did his class, when, like, about four years ago, he was like, yo, um, give him something to remember you by on the way home. Right, and then when you have so many punches like that, is that a good style of comedy? Like people will go home and remember, like a specific joke, because there's so many out there. Like you shooting a grenade, right? You shooting like I'm not, not a grenade. You shooting like a, a machine gun. Were those jokes? <clears throat> were those jokes? Uh, what he said uh, yesterday? Any of those? I mean, I mean what he said on Saturday? The jokes that y'all just quoted? Yeah, yeah, he did. Yeah, but yeah. you heard. I remember something. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, I got you. Well, that but I heard like he said, jokes. it ain't. He's like he he just said he was like Tony Roberts. It's all about being funny though. Like you know what I'm saying? It ain't. Yeah. I mean, that's I all he. I don't think he he. I don't. I I, I, I I never seen a style like that. Like when he just bro, that's, that's that, that style is so like it's so school, dope. It's so it's gym. old school, bro. It's like the earthquakes. Some it's Def like the, Jam like like like. Soon as he like, get on stage, he electrifying. Bro, you yes. got your ass beat. Yep. And the yep. crowd just, just be going eating it up. I was talking about. I was talking about this shit. The other. I was talking about this shit to 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 Shantae. Cause uh, you know she went up whatever like she funny she's so fucking funny and I said and I said man you know what I like about like his style is that like so like you like you go for like the like the punchline is like it's like it's funny like like it's just fucking like purely funny and shit yeah. it's like yo she know where the fucking funny is and shit like nowadays like a lot of comics like like they they go for the interesting you know what I'm saying the interesting and not the I mean at, at least at least from what the fuck I'm seeing or whatever yeah, yeah, yeah. nah I see like, that like there are a lot of comics that like that's that's the style like nowadays and shit like mm-hmm. that where it's like yes. oh the 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 creative the creative punchline and this mm-hmm. and this and that or whatever. <laughs> I do that. No, 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 no. But I'm saying like, yeah. So that's what I appreciate about motherfuckers like Shantae and like uh, and Tony and shit. We're like, this is it. Like yeah, this is the funny. Yeah. This is the funny. And they had some style with the act out. Bitch yeah. look like this. <laughs> Nigga look like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, 
Spread what he said, he had head. something. He said, he said, nigga, you look like he said, nigga, you look like you just shot somebody and just came in here and got a ticket. It was like, oh, nigga. like he just how you sat down was like a nigga that did something wrong was like, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like he's trying to, he's trying to, he's trying to he's he's like, they got leather seats in here. <laughs> it was just funny. He was hot on stage. He, said, he, like, he, he kept wiping yeah, his towel. He was yeah, like, bro, funny, y'all man. got. Y'all got in here like I'm about to I'm about to uh, testify like I'm about to snitch on somebody. Yeah, <laughs> man, he said that's how y'all got me sweating profusely. Yeah, I like nah. He's my he's the goat of all time. Yeah, all week all week weekend was lit, bro. Yeah, we talking about yeah like pound for pound funny, bro. Like yeah. just pound for pound funny shit. That nigga crazy. Ryan Garcia going to Joe Goosen's gym. He said he he's didn't leaving quote, Eddie Reynoso. And his quote, I I I'll let you know right now. His quote was, and I this is Ryan Garcia, not I. He said, um, reason why I left, they wanted me to cheat, so I had to leave. What do you think about that? And why is he saying that? Come on, man. Because they don't, <laughs> I, on, I, feel like, I feel like any trainer who feel like they, uh, uh, who, who wants you to cheat, I feel like they don't believe in your, your, your regular talent, no? Well, that, I'm just saying, the Canelo team, I mean, tell everybody yeah, over there. Yeah, yeah, Valdez, everybody, all them boys. They're getting caught over there, so what you think about it? They've been that, cheating. Bro? I just told I'm you what I thought about it. Yeah, but uh, but so is that basically saying what Canelo is doing and Valdez is doing and 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 he wanted Ryan to do? So is that because like they, they don't because they don't believe that uh that, like maybe that maybe the coach don't believe that they uh that they talent is enough, you know what I'm saying? That they have to cheat, mm. you know? Or maybe Canelo just doing the whole he's or, or, like bro, this how I got good. It's these steak ta- these Canelo tacos. <laughs> You don't have to come to my house for the, for the dinner. <laughs> yeah. Nah, I, I, I just think he, they criticized him too much and he left. Brian, I mean, Brian, that's soft. That man, like, Ryan's soft, man. Yeah. Like, yeah. I, don't, I'm, I ain't saying like Ryan's soft. Like, he got a lot of like anything can break him down. Like mental health. Shit. I'll be if I was fighting him next fight, I'd be like, man. Nigga, that hurt, but not as hurt, not not as much as you can't get over the hump, nigga. Yo, you can't even get out your own way. You hard head, mother. Nigga, you get sad, you depressed ass. Pump. Man, I'll be getting. If you was the fighter, yeah. Oh, 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 oh you be in his head. Oh, the ref would be like, "Hey, this is my last time warning you." <laughs> he get a warning for he get a warning for putting him down mentally, <laughs> bagging on him. Go. Like, he defeated. I don't want to come out. You're not getting hit, Ryan. I just don't want to go out there anymore. <laughs> You beat him on a TKO off of a voice. He said he, he, said he made him beat himself up. <laughs> That's crazy. Hit yourself. What? <laughs> harder. harder. <laughs> Hit yourself harder than the, six months ago when you was depressed. Yo, what? <laughs> yo, the nigga said, yo, the nigga said, uh, he had a quote that said, uh, I am a bigger star than Tank Davis. You are not a bigger star than me. And then he was like, hey, I'll put my ego aside and say it's 50 50. Mm-hmm. He said, but Tank, you were oh, like, like, why is this nigga always bringing Tank? Tank, Tank ain't tweeted and like, Tank don't even be tweeting. He don't even be like, Tank, like, man, Tank. Tank. Yeah, Tank, Tank been laying low, surprisingly. I think he's just spending time with his newborn baby. <laughs> he's like, <laughs> I don't even think Tank cares. Do you think he cares? I think he nah. cares. He wants the money. That's a good look for him. That's a good the look fight, the fight, dude. No, no, I, I don't think he care like when Ryan says his name. Nah, oh, no, yes, nah. yes, he does because you gotta understand. It's, it's boxers have egos. Mm-hmm. Like what that little bitch say to me? <laughs> like literally, that's how you think. Like what that little bitch? That's he's considered like a bitch in the boxing community. He ain't. You say you Ryan? don't. Yeah. You say you don't want to see the rematch of the dude that Tank fought the last dude. And they, yeah, you talking? Oh, you talking? You talking about Isaac Cruz thinks like Ryan is a bitch. Like I think that was a good. I think that was. I mean, yeah, but nobody nah. wants to see it again. I'm tired nah, of rematch. Yeah. You want, you want to see. They ain't worth rematching. Like, like, and then we gotta wait. And then we gotta wait six more months to see him fight again. It's like, fuck it, man. He well, he did. Break, he break his. He broke his hand. Though. Oh yeah. I don't. Know. I don't want to see that shit again. And two little niggas fighting. Hey, <laughs> you don't want to. You don't see Deontay Wilder fight dude again. And <laughs> hey, that nigga said he don't know if he coming back. Uh, he said he, he made gonna, his money though. Bro. Yeah, he said that he gonna take some ayahuasca and then and then see what his soul says. Who cool, Deontay Wilder? Mm-hmm. Damn, that nigga. Hit. Taking me some ayahuasca. What, See, you my what, is, what, is, I, what is the what ayahuasca? Think say? Hmm? What you think it'll say? What I think my soul will say? Yeah. It'll probably be like. <laughs> <laughs> what is the ayahuasca? I'm, I'm... I don't know. What is that? I don't know, nigga. What is, what is ayahuasca? Psychedelic drug. Psychedelic uh, drug. Yes, yeah, a psychedelic <laughs> drug. But it makes you see like your ancestors. Oh hell no! Nah. <laughs> that boy, that boy saw They'd Black like, Panther three times. Like, bro, that, I don't know if I, I want to drink this gorgeous, cool, this purple Kool Aid. Hey, if your ancestors, <laughs> hey, purple hey, put some hey, hey, Malik. Psychedelic. Hey, if your <laughs> an, if, 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 if your ancestors seen you, would they be proud of you? Hell yeah, they're like hey, he stood on his own tent. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. would they be like my ancestors? 
Would, guess. would they be happy like oh, he, he, all that we did? Why are you fucking all them white women? <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> and the other one's like, all right, young grandson, what was it like? I <laughs> you know, always wanted how see how she be looking, but, but master will always look away. <laughs> yeah. Man, it's crazy, man. They use <laughs> spit, <Yeah>. man. <laughs> you already had it. You already had a whole spit on your shit. I, I was close, <laughs> but then master sold me. He's <laughs> <laughs> never sold me. Hating <laughs> ass. Oh, hating ass master. <laughs> I was this close with <laughs> Master <sold> caught on. <laughs> <laughs> master. <laughs> he sold me. Man. Next question. Hey, hey you know what? <laughs> hey, hey, you know, I, I read something, right? They said the uh, you know the, you know where hush puppies came from? What? When the slaves, when they used to like be trying to escape, they used to have like balled up bread, like cornbread, and they used to throw it at the, the dogs to hush them up. They was hush puppies. I didn't even know that, bro. That's, That's why they taste so good. <laughs> hush puppies. <laughs> I love Hey, bro, that was kind of like, I was. I, I seen. Hey, I, you be quiet as hell when you eat them too, You do, but hush for puppies. a reason. <laughs> why, hush, bro, why do I not talk when I hush eat hush puppies, puppies though? Like, hush puppies. You be, yo, you don't even, not a smack. You take, it tastes like freedom. Hey, hush puppies is hella good, bro. Brush it fire. But the whole, the, I didn't even know. I'm like, damn. They so cool. soft, too. The hush puppies. No, maybe I am a nigga. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I'm cutting my ass off. <laughs> Cut. My truth coming out. <laughs> <laughs> hey, do you feel? Uh, <laughs> I was doing a show at the. I imp- want some hush puppies. What? I was doing a show at the Improv, and I, I said nigga a couple, you know, maybe a couple of more than I should have. Like, do you feel? Do you feel weird, like if you're in the white crowd, if you say nigga, like a lot? Uh, uh, you just heard him say that's that. my whole set. Uh, <laughs> uh, he, he talked like this on a, on stage. Oh, uh, okay. I, I was like. I'm like, man, I feel like I feel comfortable when I'm around with my niggas, so I might say nigga money. Oh, that, that but but Monday Rays, okay. That's a nigga, that's a nigga show. That's a, it's, yeah, it's it's a it's a black night. Yeah. So so when you were saying it, it was like, all right, bet. But I did say it a lot. It was a lot, <laughs> yeah. But then it was just to the point where it wasn't a lot of black people in the crowd. When I you mean, look around, mm. like Monday Rays is more like more like cultured a little I'm not cultured, but it's like, you know, it ain't yeah, you spread it out with different ethnicities. I think next time you go up, like you just do your set casually, like with the word nigga, but then like as time goes on or whatever, like just only say nigga. Like nigga, nigga, nigga. Like he echoing this? Nigga, 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 nigga. Just different tones? Nigga. Nigga. Thank you, and good night. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, time out. Oh, so you basically He's only saying, saying nigga. He only saying time. nigga. Whole, so, no, so jokes, he, no jokes, no nothing. So wait, so his whole set it's don't nigga. even say the N word, right? But then ended. And like yo, no. I, been, I was holding this the he's whole saying, time. Oh, no, 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 no. Do your regular set. Do your regular jokes or whatever. Nigga, the, you ever, da, 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 oh, okay, got you, got you. Nigga, nigga, you nigga, 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 nigga. Thank you, thank you, MGK. <laughs> wow, I'm gonna do that. You gonna do that? All right, fuck it. Next joke. <laughs> Next bit. What up, mom? What's happening? That's your mom. Yeah. Well, I thought he was playing. That's your mom. Don't worry about spending too much on me. Just give me the cash. That's your mom? Yeah, give you cash for Valentine's Day? <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> you said don't worry yeah, about spending. Let's call our moms. I know you delivered. Call my mom. Yeah, let's call our mom. I, I know right. you game, brother. I know. I, got, I bet. Well, look, I'm filming the podcast. I got to go, mom. Hey, let me call I'll call you later. See what she said. <laughs> you, you getting too real. All right, ma. I love you, anyway, bro. Anyway, I'll talk to you later. Don't worry call about me, bro. I'll talk to you later. All right, love you. Hello? Hey, Mom. Hey. Happy Valentine's Day. I love you. Happy Valentine's. Oh, I love you, too. Damn. <laughs> what you doing? Huh? Uh, nothing. Just shooting the podcast. My mom ain't gonna answer. Okay, well, go ahead and shoot it, baby. I'm a Syracuse. All right, I love, I love you to pieces. From the bottom of my heart. Oh, I love we'll you, talk- too. Bye. Okay. We see, we see who the Syracuse of the group is. <laughs> <laughs> mom, mom, answer. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do this in front of the company. <laughs> <laughs> mom, don't do this to me. Oh my god, <laughs> mom! What? Oh, I'm, 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 I'm glad you answered. Cause all the all the all the dudes on the podcast was, was calling their moms, and they was like, "Your mom don't love you. She ain't about to answer." I was like, "Mom, don't do this." So don't do this to me. Tell <laughs> me the fuck you want, King. <laughs> I was like, "Mom, answer." Now everybody was calling their moms. And I was like, I said, man, my mom, I said, my mom ain't going to answer. <laughs> uh-huh. And she was telling me 
Oh my god. And normally I'll say I'll call him back. <laughs> Shit, I'll call him. I'm like, okay, well, I'll call you back. I've never seen a G1. Uh, and that's what I'm I'm glad you answered, man. Y'all got kudos from the homies, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but now nah, I'll let you go talk to Diamond. I was I was I was I love you too, mom. <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> That's she gonna do. <laughs> I was like, don't do this to me, mom. <laughs> Chiquito got a mama. <laughs> <laughs> and she was like, I wasn't gonna what answer. Was like, <laughs> Did you see how he was begging? Don't do this to me, mom. The <laughs> Lejo Research Center. Who's I didn't want to. I didn't want to call. I didn't want to get singled out, bro. <laughs> Like, damn, in my mind, man. Call, you can't call number two. <laughs> like, yo, that's oh crazy, man. That's tight, he put yeah. the G in surrogate. Yeah, yo, like, I'm done. Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, mom. Hello. Man. That's crazy, man. Hey, but so hey, but what, I'm the oldest. What if your mom addressed you with this is my surrogate son? Like this, Damn. Like you just like, I mean, this you damn. Because uh, uh, if you're yeah. a surrogate and you thriving, you're like, that's you, my baby. If you but like, what if the surrogate go to the NBA, huh? He'll be oh, like, that's, oh, that's, 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 that's my baby. That's my baby. Now I don't get no hell no. That's, if, you, if you got a son that's a surrogate that. and he go to the pros, that's going to be your son. Oh, what if you had like the next, like you had a son, right? And he was a surrogate. But he was like, dad, I want to box. And you don't even care. Like, yo, you just give it to him. And he becomes world champion. Like, yeah, that's my boy. That's my baby yeah, boy. That's going to be his son. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna be like, that's my sperm. You gonna sperm. You be like, man, you gonna stick to yourself like, damn, I, I done made a world champion. I know you. I know I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. I, I, I ain't gonna lie, nigga. I'm, I'm such an analytical nigga. I would be looking at him like, what's going on? <laughs> how? How? Oh man, how? Like, how? What, like, what is it? Like, what does it do? Why is it? Why is it that good? Like, I would always refer to it as it in my head. Why is it that good? Even if they interview you, like, yo, your son, he's in a big pay-per-view fight in the main event. How you feel as a dad? What would you say? Oh, it has a lot of talent. <laughs> <laughs> like, it? You don't call, call my name like Jamar Jr.? <laughs> it's very fluid. It's, uh... <laughs> it's, Man, I have... <laughs> yeah, it's the Jamar Jr. <laughs> yo, JJ. Go get JJ and tell <laughs> me to get up. <laughs> and I'd be called to be a surrogate, though. Like, yeah, bro. Be feeling like... <sighs> How much can yeah. I... Hey, it cost, you know how much it costs? I, I know a lady that uh that had she got paid to uh have you know what I'm saying to have somebody else's baby. Was, For she, real? she got breaded out like twenty like twenty twenty some thirty racks or something like that. That's it? Yeah. Man, for, a, for man, for hope, for just shoot a baby out I the think pussy? it was like I want to say it was like twenty or thirty. I think and she it might have been like more. All like the, 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 yeah, they, they but they 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 be hella on you like like when you a surrogate, you got, they, they they want like they basically be like, I want you to go to bed this time. You got to only eat this because it's their baby. You know what I'm saying? I was gonna go to Magic Mountain. But I was asking her like because it was it was a black it was hey I was asking her because it was a black it was a black lady that had a white baby. But I was wondering like when you have a surrogate like if you have a surrogate, do you feel like? Connected to the baby, like you, you still oh, had, right, 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 you right. still had labor. You know what I'm saying? Like it's still, you still had the baby, but damn. All right, well, shit. <laughs> I almost thought G King was a surrogate. For nah, yo, man. nigga, I was I'm like, still, I'm <laughs> like, mom, yo. don't do this to me. <laughs> <laughs> when mom, he begged, dog, mom, I swear to God, I lost a little. She was like, I wasn't gonna answer, but I said, <laughs> she said what she said. <laughs> I wasn't going to answer. I was on the phone. I said, OG calling. Let me answer this. Because like, she don't be answering, bro. My bro. mom be get, my mom don't be I'll be like, mom, you get mad when I don't answer. That's hey, a mom, bro. Uh, your yeah. mom called you. Yeah. But okay. she was basically trying to, but my mom. She said she wants some cash. Yeah, she, she was, was like, like don't, don't give me a gift. Don't look, give me no candy. No, I, don't, no, I don't care about the thought. <laughs> give me some money. I was like, God, she why are we giving our mom shit for Valentine's Day? Like, that's for bitch. I mean, that's for like, my bitch. I ain't even got one of those. I think, I think that's like you supposed to give your mom. You give your mom. You supposed to give your mom something. But Valentine's, Valentine's yeah. Day is not like a relationship. It's like about love. It's a yeah, love it's like mom. I, you know, oh, I, I didn't know that. I thought it was about. Uh, I thought it was about. Oh, oh, oh. oh I didn't like know you that. get. Like I, I think I gave like my mom a card or something. Like I'm happy you can tell me. people don't know the de- definition because they yeah. was like, yo, it's Valentine's Day. I'm like, no, it's not time. <laughs> Valentine. <laughs> it's Valentine. Me. Let me see the definition of Valentine's real quick. Oh my God! All right, in uh, in other boxing news, um, hey, you did, you supposed to hit the meter, right? Nah, because remember I uh, I put two hours on. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, he, oh, he's saying it because he is about to run out. Um, <laughs> a sweetheart chosen or a complimented on Valentine. That's it. Oh, that. Oh, so you got to pick one person who you who yeah, you want to fuck it with. It says a gift or greeting sent over or given especially to a sweetheart 
Oh, Valentine. for real? Yeah. Like a greeting card. Man. Yeah. Something such as a movie piece or writing. Oh, they be making so much money off these little. Yeah. All my bitches are mean. All right. Well, that was another episode. Cutting weight. Oh, my God. That was fun. Where we at? Where we, what was that? 55. 55? Hell yeah. That ain't on a dot. That was on a dot, man. All right. All right well, that was, that was, brother, we, we, hey, give us an uh, episode recap, Jamar. All right, man. You know, uh, I got caught the N word. They went to Drake's party. Uh, surrogates, not okay. <laughs> and uh, Ryan Garcia <laughs> is my Valentine. <laughs> And that's been Pause, of course. <laughs> it's been another episode of Cutting Weight with Mally B. Thank y'all so much with Jamar Neighbors and G King. Appreciate hey. y'all. Thank you, Weight Cutters and Babies. Bro, that was the funniest shit.